Hi everyone, today I will talk about why the public static wide used with the main method. What is public? The public is a access modifier. This method will be accessible from anywhere. The main is a method. The main method must be declared as a public. Why? Because the main method will be accessible from anywhere. If I remove the main public keyword, I don't want to use the public keyword and save it. Then you compile this application. No errors to be found. Java C space file name dot Java. Then I will go for run the application. Java space main method class name. First example. The main method not found in your class first example. Please define the method as a public static wide main. Look at this statement. Why? Because the main method has to be declared as a public. Don't declare the main method as a protected or private or default. It must be declared as a public. That method will be accessible from anywhere. Then what is static? The static method will be accessible without creating an object to the class. That is the reason the static keyword has to be used with the main method. The main method will be called by JVM automatically without creating the instance to the first example. Then why should you use a wide? The main method does not return any value. Suppose instead of wide, if you use any other data type, for example, int, because int must return a value. Okay, I want to return something, return zero. Then when you do the compilation, see no errors to be found. When I run this application, The main method must return a value of type wide. Define a main method as public static wide main. You must declare main method as a wide data type. Don't use any other data type for the main. What is the purpose to use main method? The execution of the program will be start from the main and end with the main. The Java project is consist of many classes. At least one class must have the main method. The JVM will check the main method for entry of the execution. Then why use string array? The string array has to be used to provide the input to the program through the command line argument. That is the purpose the string array has to be used. The system is a final class. Out is an object of print stream class. Then println is a method of print stream class. We can invoke the println method by using this object. System dot out dot println. It is string constant. Whatever you write inside the double quote, the same thing has to be displayed on the output device. I will run this application. See, we got the output. Hi, everyone. If any doubt regarding this, please contact me at any time through the comment box. Thank you. Thank you all for watching my video.